Bucks has ever lost before. Uh, we're just going to have to see it. you you, you got to know there's something in it for both of these guys. And there's a start of round one. Rick Rufus, as we've been saying, has been having just a, a real streak. He's uh, been knocking people out. When he first started, he was winning by decisions, and he started to show some power as he moves across against using this to try to establish his front leg right off the bat there against Mike Batman Steele. Now, Steele, of course, told us earlier in the day he's not at all bashful about this. He wants to get his kicks in early, and he wants to get him into the midsection as much as he can. He thinks he can fight inside with Rick Rufus. We will see about that. Rufus, so far, um, seems to be the aggressor, and Steele countering. Steele's kind of throwing his kicks down a little bit low, and Rufus has run into a few of them that hit below the belt. Steele is carrying his hands in a very, very dangerous position. I would expect to see Rufus start to come along with that back leg round kick followed up with a good, strong left hand. He does a somewhat of a lunging type of a left, left leg, left hand technique that uh, has landed and done very well in previous fights. Rufus uh, doing a little gamesmanship there, just controlling the ring. Rufus kicks very powerful. That was a good kick into the ribs by Mike Steele. Rufus on the left, in the ribs. Mike Steele. Steele let those hands drop down, way down there. Shouldn't let them get down where they are. He takes a big step, starts in, and, and Rick just boom, right As there. As you can see, you're absolutely right, John. The right hand drops. Well, I think that a Longstreet Rufus fight is going to take a while to put together because both guys have got fights already scheduled ahead. Well, I, I look forward to it when it does, hoping to happen, and hopefully we'll be there. We'll be back with the announcer's decision right after this. Defeated fighters as he knocks out predicted. We're gonna go up to the ring announcer Larry Black now and get the official time. And the winner by his 13th knockout at 1 minute 15 seconds in the first round, Rick the Jet Rufus. Well, Rick Rufus, of course, the ISKA United States champion. A guy who is uh, certainly on a roll and uh, knocking out Mike Steele in the first round as John Worley absolutely predicted. He said it would happen just about that way as the, as the fight started. In fact, we'll go up right now to John standing by with Rick Rufus. Well, Rick, I think they're going to have to change your name to Rip the Zap. You know, it seems like they're going to start having to pay you by the round to get any time up here. Well, you know, I know I make it hard for you guys because now you have to somehow fix the show. I'm sorry, it just it happens that way. Uh, this is my business. I don't take chances, and I enjoy doing my business, so I want to stay happy and healthy. You know, you don't have to apologize for knocking guys out in any round, Rick. Uh, we're going to take a look here at this knockdown. I think we, we called it over here at the, at the ring side, talking about how you're setting up that left hand. Yes, uh, what I did was I was showing him my front leg, and uh, I was trying to set him up earlier, so I saw I wasn't able to kick him with the kick, so I saw when he kicked, I was able to come right over the top here with that left hand. How much is your, uh, your history as point fighting? How much has that really helped you in your kickboxing? It's helped me a whole tremendous amount. It's, uh, it, it's gotten me to know this ring and be able to counter fighters, move in out, and be just uh, intelligent in the ring. You've got a fight coming up with Johnny Davis. Yes, I do, and uh, I'm very, uh, I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be one heck of a good fight, and he's an number one contender, and uh, he's looking for a shot at me, and uh, I think it's going to be great. i just like to say hello to my fiance Barb, who's uh, expecting one in December, my mom, who uh, is a great supporter, and my brother Kelly, Tom, uh, Michael, and Duke, and uh, to the Big V, and all of Team Rufus who helped me uh, in this great extravaganza event. Thank you. Well, Dan, you know, we've got uh, a great champion right here with Rick Rufus. He's got some good fights coming up. Johnny Davis is going to give him a stiff challenge. The guy that walks away from that, the winner, is going to certainly be looking forward to a, a shot at John Longstreet, uh, who is the middleweight champion, and that's something we'll hope to see before the end of this series. Dan? Well, John, no question about it. The, either